Hey, what's going on everyone? This is our reviews back with another video and today I will show you guys five awesome things that you probably didn't know that you can do with your iPhone. So I didn't even know I can do most of those tricks on my iPhone. So I recently learned them and I thought it would be a good idea to share them with you. So let's get started. The first trick has to do with the spotlight search. So the spotlight search is easy to invoke from the home screen. You just swipe down and you can go ahead and search for anything on your device. But within apps, you can also have access to the spotlight search. Here's how you do it. You open an app. So while you're on an app, you want to access the spotlight search. You don't need to go to your home screen. All you have to do is just swipe down here on the notification center. Just swipe here just this much at least search bar here and release and it will take you to the spotlight search if you have an iphone 7 or 7 plus you will feel here a haptic feedback and release the finger and boom there you will have the spotlight search within any app the next trick is using force touch on the keyboard to delete faster so you can see here if i just simply press on the back button here to delete you can see how it deletes the letters, but if I force touch on it, if I press harder, this speed will be much faster. And you will also hear the sound of the keyboard when it picks up this speed. You, you can hear this sound when you do it by yourself. So, of course, you will need to have a device that has 3D touch, an iPhone 6S or an iPhone 7. So, this is normal. And this is when you press, when you press harder on the keyboard on the delete button. If you're on Safari or any other app, like on the Photos app or anywhere where you have access to the share sheet, so you can see right here, if I press that button, it will show me the share sheet. So when, whenever you see this share sheet, you can rearrange the icons on the share sheet. So for example, here on Safari, I have a request desktop site here as the first button. So you just tap and hold one of them and you can rearrange them any way you like and they will be saved. They will stay like that. So when you go back, you will have them the same in the same layout that you have organized them. It's a pretty cool and very useful feature to have here on the share sheet of iOS 10. The next trick has also to do with 3D touch. So it allows you to prioritize the download speed of an app. So if you're downloading more than two apps, you can go ahead and force touch on one of them and just click here, prioritize download, and that app will download much faster than the other apps. And the last one is a way to respring your device. So this is not a feature, this is actually a bug, but it allows you to respring your device, of course, without jailbreaking it. So here's what you need to do. You open the notification center, make sure that you have the notification center cleared. You don't have any notifications. You just press here, you just tap your with your finger here, hold your finger there, tap here on the microphone like this, then just swipe like this. And as you can see, it will respring your device. So that is it for this video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. For more videos like this, make sure to subscribe. Also, don't forget to follow me on my social media. You will find all the links in the description of the video.